Fax Mars, I don't have time for this, but I can't let this one go. Alright, in the previous video I talked about the Ring of Fire, and how I think there may be something going on with that. Something really bad. Uh, now we have this story from USA Today. Good day, mate. 1.7 billion year old chunk of North America found in Australia. Alright. Years ago, the land down under wasn't so far away after all. I mean, it was still the land down under. Rice, recent dis recently discovered in Australia, bear striking some similarities to those found in North America of study finds. Sandstone sedimentary rocks the scientists uncovered are not native to present day Australia, but are instead. Hang on. It says they come from eastern Canada. Rice are found in Georgetown, Queensland, Australia which is some roughly 250 miles west of Cairns in the northeastern part of the continent. Scientists believe that one region of what's now modern-day Australia was once attached to North America but broke away 1.7 billion years ago. After drifting around for some hundred million years, Shrunk eventually crashed into what's now Australia, forming a su supercontinent, Nuna. I've never heard of that before I've seen this uh, article. Researchers then determined that when Nuna broke apart, an estimated 300 million years afterward, that chunk of land did not drift away. Instead, it became a new piece of real estate permanently stuck to Australia. Really? This is a critical part of global continental reorganization when almost all continents on Earth are assembled to form a supercontinent called Nuna. Now don't get ahead of me. Nobody's ever heard of Nuna. Said study lead author Adam Nordsvan of Curtin University in Perth, Australia. New finding is a key step to understanding how Earth's first Soon for continent Nuna may have formed. I have kind of a sore mouth this morning, so can't swallow them up or something, so bear with me. Nuna is some, sometimes referred to as Columbia. Make up your minds! It was one of several supercontinents that existed before the most well known and recent one, Pangea. It, they're saying they had supercontinents wandering all around the planet. I can't deal. I'm sorry. Study was published in the peer-reviewed journal Geology. I can't deal. I mean, now they're telling us they had supercontinents wandering all over the planet. All over the place. Sorry. It's not going to happen. I'm not buying this. You don't wonder why people turn to conspiracy theorists? Well, look at stories like this. See, this. Unbelievable. But that's why it's called a mad science update, because <laughs> these are mad scientists. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Shouldn't be spending time on videos, but I can't resist. Thanks for watching.